Project 6C, packing and applying a pressure bandage on an arterial bleed. Kindly note, wearing protective clothing is recommended. Non-medical professionals may freely take part in this simulation project and are also allowed to apply the skills gained on real patients in an emergency or disaster situation. You will need the control bleeding simulation arm, the IV bag filled with colored water or saline connected to an IV tube, the sphygmomanometer, five to 10 gauze squares, a roll of pressure bandage, cloth for packing. Follow these steps. All participants should don a pair of clean gloves. Open the IV tube roller clamp and ensure that the pressure in the blood pressure cuff is still in the region of 120 millimeters mercury. Immediately follow with tightly packing the wound with a cloth. Persist with applying pressure. Tightly roll a pressure bandage around the arm over the packed cloth covering the bleeding point. If there still is any significant residual bleeding, apply hand pressure over the bandage. Open the blood pressure cuff valve allowing the cuff to deflate. Simulate bleeding in a hypertensive patient by increasing the cuff pressure to 160 millimeters mercury, for instance. At the end of the project, open the blood pressure cuff valve, allowing the cuff to deflate. Then, close the IV line roller clamp and disconnect the IV tube from the simulation arm.